So before working with us, what was your situation? And what were you feeling? What was going on? <laughs> well, I moved to Heath, um, having been a resident here as a kid, and now coming back as a business owner, I didn't. I knew people, but I didn't really know anybody. Um, and uh, a friend of mine had, had recommended you guys. Chad was like, "You need you need to call Chair Beanies," and uh, so I did. Um, I've not done a lot of advertising. Uh, my practice in Nashville was all physician referral. I never needed uh, to do it. So here we are, 16 years into practice, and I know about as much as advertising uh, as I do about Mongolian literature. I know nothing about it. Starting over. It's starting over at 44 and with a business in a small town that may or may not be ready for what I do. Um, I know there's a need, but I don't know that they know there's a need, and how do you tell people that? How do you tell people about something brand new and let them know it's gonna help? So um, I reached out to you guys. I had talked with a number of other people. Um, everybody and their mother beating down your door about doing marketing for you when you open, you know, as soon as you open up. Uh, some of them you can see through, some of them a little more difficult to see through. Um, but I can honestly say this is the first marketing I've ever done that has not only paid for itself, but paid for itself month by month, starting month one. Um, you guys went above and beyond everything you said you were gonna do, and that's never happened with, with any of the advertising, anything I've ever done, um, what little it's been. You know, I was just plugging away, not knowing what I was doing, putting goofy stuff, off, stuff up on Facebook, not knowing what I'm doing. I mean, I, I had no direction, but uh, you guys came in, said this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna get some exposure, we're gonna build this uh, marketing thing for you and um, phone calls came in I think it was like 31 calls in two weeks uh, 31 contacts in two weeks and uh, if we grow this coming year like we did we have this first eight months um, I'm gonna be out of space uh, a year before my lease is up and um, here we are eight months in I'm already looking to add two more treatment rooms uh, to the space we're in um, to make sure that we're ready for the growth. So, um, flywheels just getting started too. <laughs> so I'm excited. Momentum's about coming, that. baby. Yeah. So if you're on the if you're talking to somebody else that wants to work that needs what we do, I think you already told them that. <laughs> what you, somebody sitting on the fence? What do you tell them? Well, I would tell them two things. First, I would say, why would you not give it a try? You know, the, my, my biggest thing was uh, I wish I'd have found you guys when I op before I opened my doors and started that process a month before I opened. Um, it would have been worth the risk. You guys put everything on the table, said here's what it is. It's been an open book. Um, there's a face to go with it. It's not some company off in La La Land somewhere. Like if something goes wrong, I can pick up the phone or shoot a text or call. Um, all the data's tracked real time. So I know I get a text message when a phone call comes into my clinic, and I know if it's been followed up with, an email. Um, every step of the way, I know, I know and see every lead, and there's never been any doubt, there's never been any, any question that you guys aren't doing your jobs. It's above and beyond, even. So, um, you know, I've, I would just say don't be stupid.